don't have all the info on this one. All we know is there's a nail shop in Chicago. But uh, hindsight, I, I'd, I'd probably just give them the 40 bucks. Now look, I, I, I tell everybody all the time, don't go running at someone like you're going to do something unless you're ready to do it. Come on! Let's do it! Let's do it! And why would you send the woman up to the door to lock it? What about old tough guy? Let him go up there. Oh, my money, money? bro. What that month talking about? You stay standing me, bro. Please don't go. Please don't send my boyfriend. 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 Please don't send my I'm going to say it again. $40. I mean, let's just think about it. Wouldn't you rather just giving him the 40 bucks back than get the whole shop busted up? I mean, <laughs> you got to think about it. It. Is it worth it? What's wrong with you? you? Now we've crossed the line. You see, you've done more than $40 worth of damage. There's no chance of getting your money back now. There's nothing you can possibly do to make me give you forty dollars. Look at the shop. Look, look. Take a look around. Damn. Give us the money back. The money. I ain't gonna sit here and act like I ain't done some stupid stuff in my youth too, but. Neither one, nobody was held accountable. These two are still on the loose and have, no charges have ever been filed. 